many developing countries, a major constraint faced by farmers is the feeding of their livestock. Ni kalitaun villa umena nyum si fanta dry fate fanta dry food senwe mambul vi tu kini mambul villa saya sedia food sakafun nyum bumbun villa di mesek saya mambul arak si karasan villa bis vali kalitaun tena si fanta dry mit. This issue is due to the low availability of resources, but also to their nutritional quality, which varies greatly and very quickly throughout the year. Farmers are aware that they need to feed their animals properly to ensure milk production and therefore guarantee their own food security. But farmers rarely order laboratory analysis of the different feeds given to the animals because they are very expensive. <laughs> These laboratory analyses are time-consuming and expensive because they require the use of chemical reagents and specialized technicians. Thus, this method is not adapted to the needs of smallholder farmers in developing countries. A more precise and rapid control of feed quality would imply the use of tools and methods that are more accessible at a lower cost, that are easy to use and quick to implement, and if possible, portable in order to provide immediate advice to the farmer on his farm. La spectrométrie dans le proche infrarouge ou SPIR est une méthode analytique basée sur le principe d'absorption d'un rayonnement électromagnétique par la matière. C'est une méthode analytique permettant de faire une analyse successive d'un grand nombre d'échantillons et l'obtention de résultats d'une manière instantanée. Cependant, Elle nécessite une phase de calibration basée sur des analyses de référence obtenues en laboratoire et l'établissement de modèles mathématiques permettant de relier les informations spectrales aux résultats de ces mesures. In the animal nutrition field, the main parameters to characterize a feed are the dry matter, the proteins, the lipids, the starch, the fibers, the ashes and the organic matter digestibility. Sirad have been using NIRS for over 10 years and has several calibration equations for laboratory stationary devices. The development of portable devices, such as LabSpec, allow in-situ analysis and the immediate characterization of different resources, such as fresh forage, silage, and concentrated feeds. NIRS can also be used for soil or organic matter analysis. It can also provide information on soil fertility in order to optimize the forage production. CIRAD, with the support of Kroll researchers, coordinates from Reunion Island a scientific research network in six countries of the Indian Ocean region, within the framework of ArchNet and BIOVA projects. Their work focus is on the development of different resource calibrations and on the improvement of technical and environmental performances of ruminant production systems. The priority is given to developing countries and to the farmers' needs. La restitution des résultats au niveau des éleveurs permettra d'améliorer la qualité de l'alimentation du bétail par une meilleure formulation des rations, un apport alimentaire plus équilibré en fonction des besoins des animaux. Et ceci permettra aussi d'augmenter les perfor performances productives des animaux. In practical terms, the in situ determination of the forage and feed's nutritive value allows a real time adjustment of the animal ration as well as an optimal management of pastures and fodder stocks. Improvements in input management will also have a positive impact on a farm's environmental performances. Thus, the portable NIRS represents a tool capable of responding to the FAO-recommended approach since 2011, produce more with less.